Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming with another episode of No Man's Sky. Alrighty, when we left off, my throat was a little more stable, so I could say things, but also, we were completing minor missions here and there, getting things done where we could, and uh, exploring new little places every once in a while, like the planet we're currently on right now. It's a little, uh, it's a little sparsely populated, but nonetheless, it's got some cool things to look at, kind of. I was trying to, there we go, I was trying to figure out what this was, and it wouldn't let me target it again. Alright, um, that's an unidentified plant. Cool. What's that? That's a salvage container over there. Interesting. Come take this knowledge stone. Corvac's word for data. Oh, that makes sense. Alrighty. So. I said. <laughs> I realize now I said sparsely populated, and then you have these floating crab things. <laughs> anyway. I'm gonna actually get out of here real quick. Well, bye. Uh-oh. Now I'm at zero launch thruster energy. Oh, no. Um. Oh, I have plenty of that. <laughs> what am I thinking? Alright. That brings us down to 11. That ain't too bad. Could have been far worse. Alright. Well. Um. The mission we were doing here was taking a picture of... I think? Wasn't it? Or is this a different thing? The mission target is in another system. Why was I here then? I don't remember. <laughs> I don't recall why I'm here. Uh, multi-tool. Aha! Huh. I'm wondering now why I was here. I don't know. I don't actually remember why I was here on this planet. Well, I seem to have gone right back to the start of the game. Not sure why I'm here on this planet. Just with more tools at my disposal. Okay. Um, was it to do that? No, maybe, but no, I don't think so. Hmm. It might have been, but I doubt it. Crusade. Hunt and destroy targets. Okay, well. Why not? We'll just do this, since... My brain has no idea what I'm currently doing otherwise. Um, I don't have anything else going on I can use. Switch starship view on. Emergency warp. Scan for trade outpost. Bite beat library? Oh! I could have a playlist of music? Huh. Didn't know I could do that. That's interesting to find out now. But we're going to head over to this bounty mission target. And take care of them. When we get there. key phrase being when we get there, but nonetheless, when we get there. I'm now at 50% of my pulse engine fuel. Mm -hmm. Getting more and more uh, closer to empty as time goes on. 
much to my chagrin. But here we are, coming up on them. And booyah, whoop. Okay. Okay, well, doing some damage. That's good. Getting damage done, and that's the important part. Whip. Away you go, you little shit. There we go. And done. Booyah. Got your stuff. Oh, ow. You little bastards. You at? You little shit. You little bastards. Go ahead. Destroy the shit out of you. Back in my line of sight, you fucker. There we go. Alright. You? Okay, alright. Alright. You had to be pulling weird magical fucking laser shit out of your ass. That's a little too early to swear. <laughs> There we go. Whoop. Okay. One more. Well, I got one ship with that. Really? There we go. Got you. Whoop. Almost. Whoops. Okay, could one of you stop doing that? There we go. You're crap. Alright. Where's this last ship at? Right here. Well, you didn't last for long, did you? Okay. Did that do it? Did that do it? Did I win? I won. Okay. Huh. <sighs> I'm a nuisance. That's what that makes me? A nuisance? Okay. Alrighty. Whatever you say. I think that would make me a pirate hunter, but okay. Test subject. Okay, that makes me a little more worried. Scrapper. Okay. Oh, I already discovered this. Okay, fair enough. Is that the planet I was on? No, I don't think it was. Because I could have been going... What the hell? Is that a moon? Oh, no, it's not a moon. I was wondering if that was a moon of the planet that I was looking at. No, it's just a big chunk of rock. Alright. Okay. That could have gone much worse. All things considered. Huh. I don't know if that was the planet I was on previously. Might have been. Could have just been there for uranium. I don't know. Especially considering how much uranium I have in my inventory. It's not a lot, but it's some. Could have been why I was there. But quite frankly, I don't know. Well... I don't know where I'm going. I don't know where I'm trying to point me, myself. Uh, to the mission agent. Okay. Well, we can do that. Mm, 
might as well do that. Space station seems to be just outside of New Urolin. Urolin? No. Urolin, Urolin. That could be anything. All right. Well, hello. Didn't expect that, but okay. Got another fleet sitting just outside. Or rather, another freighter and its fleet. Okay. Well, go here. There we go. Whee! Spinning around. <laughs> And here we go. Good. All right. Well, let's go back to the mission agent and drop off all those missions that I've completed so far. Yes, you. Right here. Talk to you. There we go. A list of missions and their associated rewards. Let's hand in the missions I've already done. Which is this. For a decent amount of units. Okay. Good. Uh, the hunting pirates to get to Hypnotic Eye. Which, I'm not sure what that's about, but okay. And the hunting sentinels for nanites. I've earned the title of mercenary. <laughs> nice. Cool. Alright. A warp hypercore reward just to deliver an item. Hmm. Interesting. The client dispatches a large number of items every day. Their business involves tight profit margins, and even the slightest or lightest of tax schemes could wipe out their gains. They find it generally more efficient to employ a discreet courier who just happens to deliver their item while on their ordinary non-commercial business. Aha. Will be supplied with a defense chit in case of a pirate attack. Hmm. Well, that seems a little shady, but... The client is tired of being humiliated by local wildlife. Every time they set foot upon a world, they can feel the mocking compound eye stares burning into them. The passive-aggressive oof-stomping ringing in their ears. Teach these creatures a lesson. Ah... Uh... The client seems uh, cuckoo bonkers crazy, but sure, yeah, why not? Let's do the thing. Yeah, that's a good idea. I guess. Uh oh, seems weird to me, but whatever. I'll give them the money. Well, I'll get the money by giving them the murder that they desire. I guess. Descented pheromone bottle. The what? A defense chit. I meant to look at that too. Defense chit. A token entitling the bearer to support from the system authorities in dealing with pirate attacks. Or I could just pocket that and not use it. I guess this is the thing I have to bring. That's pretty nice. 57,000 units just for a hypnotic eye. No wonder they were offering that as a reward. Alright, well. Meaty chunks. Sure, why not? 
Uh, I could sell the defense chip. Um, nah, nah. And I don't really need ion batteries that badly. Although, now that I think about it, I do need to get rid of some of the stuff on my uh, starship. I think? I'm not sure. Um, the Lemium? I don't know if there's something I can use that for. I don't know what I can use Herox for, but I think there's crafting recipes that I can use them for. I just don't know off the top of my head. Crafted from pure ferrite and uranium and chlorine and ammonia. I mean, I, f I can craft them eventually. Then I guess I don't need to worry too much about holding on to them. Especially while my storage space is limited. So, put that there. There we go. And put that in there. Ah! I had pyrite right there. Cool. Cool, good to know. Um, the descented pheromone bottle. I guess that's the thing I need to sell. Or rather, deliver. Alright. I assume, actually. I'm not entirely sure. Deliver the goods to the secure depot. Huh. Well. Might as well do that. Yep, it's the descented pheromone bottle to the secure depot. I was correct in that regard. Milestone accomplished. I mean. Oh! Looks like I've made that many units. That's cool. I kind of want a frigate. Kind of eventually want a frigate. Uh, if only. Okay, um... Secure Depot. Where is it, though? Uh, I don't think it's here. I don't think it's here at all. I don't think it's there, either. But. Oh, when? Galaxy map. It is to be delivered to Suwanu. Suwanu system. Huh. I guess that explains why the uh, reward gives you a warp hypercore. Or what's it that? I don't remember, honestly. <laughs> I don't remember what it gives me, but it's fine, it's fine, it's all fine. Unknown planet. Might as well scan it, see what it is. Of course. Of course, it detected the gold. Of course it did. Well. Well. Got you. Got you. Alright, well that worked out as well as I could have hoped. Kind of. Um, okay. Alright. Eventually, I'm going to beat you. Eventually, I'm going to beat you. Get back here. Get back here, you bish. Damn pirates. 
There we go. Good. Ha! Ah. Gotcha. You think you, you think you're done? You, think you can run? No, you can't. All right. We're good. Somehow, we're good. All right, well. Time to do this again. Troublemaker. Well, technically they were causing trouble. I was just defending myself. So, I mean, if anything, you know, call them troublemakers. I am just a hero. Yeah, that makes sense. Anyway, down we go. Wee! Oh boy. All right. Time to land and deliver the goods. As we ought to do. Nice. Flora abundant, fauna rich, sentinels frequent. Crap. Well, hey. Could be worse, right? Local trade center. And we... Delivery terminal access. The client's secure lockbox will handle all the scanning and other administrative tasks. All I need to do is hand over the item. Well, then there you go. Delivery processing success. Yay! I did the thing. Prefect Nugia. Interesting. Interloper Rups. Your will the Viking. Okay, fair enough. But does the warrior snarls, but does so deferentially. It makes it, they make it clear that they are willing to talk to me. Okay, well, let's learn some words. <laughs> Prefect Nugia nods thoughtfully, then presents a list of language symbols. Uh, aggression? Learn the Viking word for blood. Oh, good. Joy. What about recruit uh, Yabloon here. Bra. Era Tuhanji in the Liang of Ilgofa. Pathetic. Okay, all right, whatever. Alrighty. Keeps looking at my multi-tool. They appear envious of its technology. Okay. They present a screen of symbols. Uh, trade. The word for get. Okay. Okay. Uh, practice the uh, language skills. Uh, multi-tool, since they were looking at mine. Y recruit Yabloon glances over my equipment, then cringes as their eyes land on my multi-tool. Seeming embarrassed, they hastily offer an upgrade for it. Okay. They give me a plasma launcher. <laughs> they give me the ability to make a plasma launcher for my <laughs> multi tool. Alright, well. They first appeared envious of the technology, only to then <laughs> be like, oh, you don't have this thing? Fuck, peasant, take this. Go away. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Uh, let's talk about. Let's talk to the prefect here. Uh, language skills. Uh, I learned blood from them, right? So let's say blood. Blood. Looks outraged by the word. Oh boy. Uh oh. Sorry. <laughs> Didn't mean to piss you off. Sorry. Corporal is just sitting in the chair. Pathetic warriors. This is not Viking. This is something. I don't know. Though it doesn't show in their complexion or posture, this is a very old Viking. Wisdom accrued from a lifetime of interstellar warfare burns bright in their eyes. 
The Elder seems disapproving of the crowd here, glaring uneasily at the other Vikings. Whatever society they were once accustomed to, this motley gathering of warriors does not reflect it. So I'm talking to the boomer Viking? Is that what it is? Sympathize. <laughs> I'll just be a boomer with them. Whatever their concerns with modern Viking society, the input of an outsider is of no significance. I could not possibly understand. However, capitalizing on a sympathetic ear, the Viking raises a more specific complaint. They indicate the time and grunt with impatience. They are awaiting a delivery in this awful place. How slowly the hours pass. Uh, ask for a story. They pat their weapon, looking misty-eyed. We lack the common tongue for complex dialogue, but happy to share. They deliver their story via a methodical sequence of grunts, gestures, and holograms. It is slow, but surprisingly engaging. They describe what must be centuries of war against the Sentinels. Countless comrades have fallen, but while each unique Viking life is irreplaceable, the machines seem infinite, unaffected by individual losses. Now in their twilight years, corp the Corporal is seizing their final chance to find and destroy the source of the Sentinel Force. They are only machines and must be assembled somewhere. They must be. The elderly Viking sighs. Their gruffness softens as they reevaluate the Viking crowd around us, each life precious. They thank me for listening and give me something to further my own journey. A dagger! Well, thank you, good sir. Acknowledges me with a punch followed by an embrace, possibly in tradition with Viking fashion. They indicate that they have nothing further to discuss. Okay. Well, that makes sense. But hey! I bonded with the boomer. <laughs> <laughs> over how the world has changed around them. <laughs> the warrior is busy scratching markings into the paintwork of their weapon. Their work is as of yet incomplete, but they are clearly proud of their progress. Okay. I'm going to learn some words from you. How about... Symbol of the Viking. The Ancients. Alrighty. Gra Interloper. My weapon. Okay. Fair enough. Um, practice language skills. Uh, Multi-tool. Assumes I'm talking about their multi-tool. They grip it defensively. Okay, well that wasn't what I intended, but oh well. Did I? I already talked to this guy, didn't I? No, I have not. This is young. Conscript Yang. Gra. <laughs> the warrior keeps looking at my multi-tool. Okay, um, well. Let's see if this goes the same way I expect it to. Uh, Conscript juts their jaw forward, looking skeptical. They spelled skeptical wrong. I rack my brain for my most impressive Viking vocabulary. Uh, multi-tool? Looks nervous as though I've put them on the spot. They don't seem confident in their knowledge on the subject. Okay. Actually, let's learn a word from you before I go. Okay. Oh, I could practice language skills again. Um, honorable. Chuckle softly to themselves, as though they don't quite believe I understand the meaning of this word. <laughs> okay. How about... Get. Looks annoyed. They flex a huge bicep, a reminder that they are a warrior, not a merchant. Understandable. Oh, great. So, I pissed him off. Alright, well. Fair enough. Then request dialect help. Um, aggression symbol. Coward, huh? Okay, so. I can't learn anything more from them. That's fine. Whatever. Okay. 
Practice language skills. Hmm. Um, ancient. Why not? Quietly impressed. They murmur the word back to me. Hey, well, there you go. I upped my loss to Viking standing just a little bit. Now I'm basically back where I started. I've met 20 aliens. How about that? Hmm. Oh, son of a bitch. I was going to talk to you. Bastard. I only also just noticed that there is a mountain where it ought not be. <laughs> That's silly. How, how did this happen? How did this happen? That's what I want to know. And why am I not allowed to fix it? Oh, jeez. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Ah! <laughs> Ow. Ow. That hurt. Well, what the, why am I getting hurt again? <laughs> okay, um, why is it? At a certain point, it just stops letting me do anything. I don't know why it's doing that. weird. But anyway. Yeah, it just it stops letting me do it. At a certain point, it just stops letting me do it. That's weird. Anyway. Screw it. I'm just gonna continue doing this until I've cleared out this path that I am intending on clearing out. The consequences be damned. I don't... I don't understand why this happened. Honestly, I... It's like an entire landing pad here that just... got encased by a rock and just no one cared to fix it or anything. It's so weird. Did your ship just... <laughs> okay, sure. Why not? Yeah, sure. That makes sense. Yeah, that makes so much sense. Yeah, sure. We'll just occasionally we'll... It'll just put my weapon away for me, and then it won't let me continue. And then I have to pull it out again before I even get any more progress done. Fuck! I don't get it! I don't understand! Screw it! I don't think I'll ever understand. Alright. Whatever. I don't even care. Damage container. Okay. Alright. Whatever. Moving on. From the silliness. And... Install plasma launcher. I don't want to do that. Viking dagger, Gak relic. Just put that there. Ah. Huh. All 
I don't know when I got a Gek Relic, but no. Well. Um, utilities. Swap multi-tool. I don't have extra multi-tools. <laughs> yes. Undoing more. More in this entire area. Why? I don't know why. Just for shits and giggles, I guess. <laughs> ah, screw it. I don't even care. I don't care that much. I just... <laughs> just wanted to do something about this, because it didn't make sense. Alright, um... Terminal. Okay. Um... I guess I could sell that. I could sell this, but I kind of don't want to at the same time. Um, Herox. Lemium. There we go. And I guess that's good enough. And that, uh, yeah. Put this over here where that belongs. I guess we'll call that good. Sure, why not? Alright, uh, actually, now I think about it. Um, let's recharge the mining beam and recharge recharge. the terrain manipulator. Uh, yeah. Cool. Yeah, that takes care of that. Fantastic. Well, fantastic-ish, I guess. Um, that's not the button I wanted. I wanted this one, so I can unpin the formula. I don't need that. Creatures. I guess culling the creatures just is... Any creatures I see. Okay, fair enough. I guess I can do that. Sure. Any creatures I really want. Huh. Well. Kind of curious what this is. Primary element of carbon. Hmm. Oops. And. Yeah, that was going to lead to pain. I knew it, but I did it anyway. Alright. Some sodium. What is this here? This is... Has radon. Why does this have radon? That's weird. Oh, anyway. Well, hi there. You gonna be mad at me in a second? No. Okay. I figured it would be mad at me in a second, but I guess it was not going to be. Alright, Dustin Carbon. Alright. Okay. This is this a plant? Yeah, this is a plant. That's a weird looking plant. Tell you what. Alright, um. Oh, shit, you little bastard. Alright, oh. Carve you down. Nothing. Get Alright, and... Get a snapshot of that animal. There we go. And these plants. And these animals. It'll let me. There we go. Two. All right. So far, so good. Look for red and green dots to locate creatures. Okay, sure. Ow. 
Does this count as a creature to kill? Does that count? I'm curious, actually. Um, log. No, it does not. But I'm sure this one does. Yes, it does. Meaty chunks and more die. All right, that's fair. What the hell is this thing? Produces a vile stench. Okay. Uh oh. Yeah, I was expecting that. Okay, time to run. Time to run. <laughs> Didn't expect there to be uh, immediate bounty on me by the Sentinels just for doing that, but here we are. That is fine. It's fine. Yay, deactivated. Well, that saves me for now. And there we go. Okay. Well, this is probably not going to end well if I don't get away from it. Yeah, I had a feeling. Oh, haven't identified ladder. Okay. There's that taken care of. Don't know what that is. Kind of curious. All right, dust. Okay. Ooh. Almost didn't see this. Viking word for must. Huh? There we go. Reload. Perfect. And... Where am I sitting? Proto sausage. A nutritious meat product harvested from the corpse of the creature that once contained it. Well, I mean. Process in a nutrient processor to generate edible products. Huh? Makes sense. You are. So tiny. Or so tiny. Well, I mean, I expected it to be young, considering how tiny it is. Gender prime. What, the, what does that mean? Gender prime. Okay. Gender prime. Gender prime. Gender orthogonal. Oh, I don't know what orthogonal means, but okay. That is a big plant right there. Scan these things. There we go. Spawns in water. Curious what you are, too. Okay, got you. I'm gonna scan this. Okay. So, at this point now I'm just killing creatures. I killed that surprisingly quickly. Huh. And I honestly expected the Sentinels to be immediately on my ass after that, but... I guess not. Not unless I am right next to one when I start firing, which I guess I was with the first one. Oops. Well, hi there. Well, it's probably gonna 
head over and see the body that I just made. No? No? Okay. It's not. I'm just going to take that as a blessing and run away. Alright, what is that, anyway? This here. It's a copper deposit. What's copper? Eh, that was a decent amount of copper. Don't really need to get more. But, I mean... More copper's probably always good. Down you go. Oh boy. Reload time. And get rid of you. There we go. It's a mature male. This one was... What is this? An adult nun. Okay, that's fair. Frequently regurgitates. Gross. Just gonna mine down some crystals. Because why not? All right, well, I guess right now I am just going to be hunting down those particular creatures. Because those proto-sausages are, uh, pretty spendy. That's not what I meant. Oh, pretty, rather valuable, I should say. Ow! Oh, create creature pellets. That's right. I don't want to, but I mean, that's something I can do. Alright, well, anyway, I'm going to run around, do that whole thing. New entry on feeding and taming creatures. I will do that someday, but not today. Actually, I need the mining bee for all of these. Anyway, I'm going to end the episode here for right now, because we've gone for a little bit of time. And I figure might as well focus on the hunt for a little while. So, I'll go and do that. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. Click the like button if you like this particular video. And share in comments so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together and I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one the only Stray Cat playing games and getting missions done uh, just to build up you know, my resources to then have cooler stuff later, hopefully. And, uh, in general, just be a nuisance to sentinels and the wildlife of planets alike. That's kind of what I do best, right? A little bit. Inadvertently. And advertently. I'm not sure if that's the proper use of that word, but I'll find out for you.